Today's story is The Green-Eyed Monster. Ari runs down to the big tree in the backyard. He has taken a gold trophy from his brother Tad's bedroom and hidden it under his jacket. I'm going to hide this where Tad won't find it, ever. He pushes the trophy into a hole in the tree as far in as his arm will go. Now I won't ever have to look at it again and I hope Tad never gets another one. He hears a little voice above coming from a branch on the tree. Is that a little monster? One with green eyes. Did it just say something? Yes, he heard, Ari, Ari, never say well done. Ari, Ari, come and have some fun. Is the monster saying being jealous is fun? Yes, Ari thinks. The monster is right. It will be fun when Tad realises his trophy is gone. Ari is the youngest child in a big, happy family, the Radus. The five Radu kids are always winning prizes at school and sport. Alex came first in the school drawing competition and won $10. John won the 100-metre running race at the school carnival. Maria was praised for the poem she wrote about their mother. Mike is a good swimmer, and Tad is school captain as well as being a winner at soccer. Ari is still little, so he hasn't won any awards yet. He is really jealous of his brother's soccer award. Actually, he is jealous of all the awards his brothers and sisters win. He will never say well done when they win something. Now Tad has won a very impressive trophy for being the best soccer player in the under-13s team. Ari secretly hates the way he feels, angry, but sad too. He hopes he'll feel better if he gets rid of Tad's prize. The green-eyed monster said being jealous is fun. Let's see if that is true. That night, Tad notices his trophy is missing. Ari sees a tear in his eye. His big brother never cries? He must be feeling bad, realises Ari. He hears the green-eyed monster laughing in the corner behind the sofa. He hears, Ari, Ari, never say well done. Ari, Ari, come and have some fun. Strangely, though, Ari doesn't feel like having fun. Laughing at his brother's tears would make him feel ashamed. He is about to go watch television when his dad calls him over. He says he is proud of Ari because he keeps trying so hard at soccer. Dad says he has been watching Ari kicking the football around the yard, practising different goal-scoring moves. One day, Ari... You'll be as good at soccer as your big brother, Tad. You will win awards too, he said. We'll be telling you well done very soon. When I was young, about your age, there was a little green-eyed monster that used to come around when my brother won something at school. It tried to make me feel jealous. It used to say, Jerry, Jerry, never say well done. Jerry, Jerry, come and have some fun. Ari is shocked. What did you do, Dad? He asked. At first, I wanted to be mean when my brother won an award. I even thought about tearing up the certificate he won for good spelling. The green-eyed monster was telling me how much fun it would be. Then my father helped me out. He gently took the certificate out of my hand and returned it to my brother's room. He told me that letting the green-eyed monster tell me what to do would make me unhappy, not happy. He said being happy for someone actually makes you feel happy too. Suddenly, Ari hears a shout from Tad's room. He has found his trophy. It was under the bed. Huh? Ari is so happy. 
Dad was right about that. But how did the trophy get back from the hole in the tree? Maybe Dad saw Ari hide the trophy when he was watching him in the backyard. Yes, he must have seen everything and wanted to give Ari a chance to send the green-eyed monster far, far away, just like his dad had helped him. Ari decides the next time that green-eyed monster shows up with its mean rhyme, he will tell it loudly, I will always say well done. Go away, green-eyed monster, because I have won. Well done, Tad, Ari says, and he truly means it. The lesson we learnt today is that we should be happy for others when they achieve. We hope you enjoyed this Schooling Online production. Check out the rest of the stories in our Life Stage series to help your child cope with developmental changes.